Hello! Welcome to this FBF Let's Play of Minecraft. Yes, Minecraft. I'm Minecraft. By the way, in case that wasn't obvious. <laughs> yes. Yes. It's Mr. Uh, Go to Bed there, look. I'm looking at him on my uh, camera. I'm looking at him too, look at that. Look <laughs> at him. <Hello. laughs> and this is Sean. I'm normal, honest. <laughs> <laughs> With his snazzy 3D glasses on. Terry. And this is me. There's Hello. Terry. Look at Terry. Oh. Oh. Terry, the security Come guard on. guy. Yeah. Oh, I need uh, food. I'm going to die if I don't eat. <laughs> oh, an egg sandwich. I'll have that. So we've we've uh, started a Minecraft Let's Play because nobody else is doing anything like that at all. No. No one at all. The, the, you, the YouTubes and things are empty. Empty. We saw a gap in the market and we decided to go for it. Well, it's, well, there is a bit of a gap because we're doing a multiplayer let's play. We we're are. using lots of mods and it isn't tech it. It's not tech it at all, is it, Terry? No. It's kit. It's, it's, yes, something like that. We may need to think of a better name between games. <laughs> yes. Maybe. Name to be confirmed. <laughs> uh, we decided the best way to do what we're going to do is for Terry to make it up and then we're just playing the world yeah um, Basically, it's a, it's a custom server with a custom client that's running so we don't have to use any of this illegal tech it nonsense and we're going to basically be creating our sort of law for our if if any of you listen to our podcast, you would have uh, which you heard, do, which you should do. Yes, it's on our website. It's amazing. <laughs> you would have heard things such as the Tech Ninja Dojo, the Castle, the Retro Ranch, the Indie Cave, and other such things. The Indie the Cave, which they can see in my waypoint at the moment. <laughs> yes, this is actually the Indie Cave. Let's let's pop outside. One of yes, that's the, the Indie Cave, oh, just okay. there. But yes, basically the the whole plan is is to basically build all these places in Minecraft. Which is I realised I should have put this on the sign the first time. It would have been. Indicate <laughs> mark one, mark one. Good news, good news. It is now. So decided, yes. rather than to start off as lots of other Minecraft mod, uh, Minecraft let's plays <laughs> start off with us just standing on the surface going, let's get some wood. Uh, beforehand, we'd actually gather some supplies and yes, uh, so at least a few. Build so a here, shelter for ourselves. we have this. Oh, we have this. <laughs> we have this. We have this incredibly scary view. I have this. Jordan and myself walk through the door at the same time, <laughs> and I see the inside yeah. of his head. <laughs> so yes, we have a few bits and bobs just to skip over the initial, you know. Gathering. Dullness of the punching trees business. This is the Indie Cave Mark 1. Yes. With a uh, nice picture up here. We have a painting, which I'm sure we're all seeing differently. Yes. Yep. <laughs> so there's time now for some fancy, like, three way um, <laughs> changes between the streams. We're recording. The, the different texture packs we're all using. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm just being boring and using the standard one. I'm oh, I'm not the only one. <laughs> okay, but apparently Sean is the only one using a different texture pack. Oh, it's going to be a, everyone's going to be saying, "Oh my God, Sean's view is amazing." Right, Sean, you need but to mention what I texture pack you're using, otherwise we'll get the eight thousand comments of what texture pack are they using. <laughs> I am using pure BD craft. Ah, pure BD uh, craft. Just because I keep seeing it in quite a lot of videos, and it looks really nice and shiny. And you've got have, to, have you got the fully modded one then? Yeah. I've got the one modded for the ticket and awesome. So to the left of our and the other is Terry's room. Yes, look, I've got a fabulous birch lined room. Look how amazing it is. He's got no headroom at all. <laughs> Literally just enough space in there to get into bed. And interestingly enough, just me going to bed made it morning. Hmm, what? How how bizarre. <laughs> it's special that way, Terry. Yes. That's strange. I am <laughs> God. To the right of the entrance is my little hidey hole. 
with his little cobblestone walls. My little cobblestone wall. I have actually got a nice little um, <laughs> hidden right. hole up here that I think I should put a chest into and hide some stuff in. Yeah, you have lots of now, headroom. But I have lots of we, headroom here, but not so much here. But no. now we know where your secret chest is going to be. <laughs> yes. So yeah. Nickel. Oh. And then upstairs, because caves have stairs now. Apparently so. Of my open plan bedroom. <laughs> yes. Yeah, but you're the luckiest one. You've got like a balcony. I do. And then we come uh, out here and we have the balcony. And if I could shut the door rather than just punching things next to it. I just. Oh, the bloody door! <laughs> we uh, come down on our rubber trees and our regular trees and our cactus plantation. And I have to admit, the spawn has kind of gone down a quite a substantial yes, amount. Yes, I can only see like two pigs. That's li oh, and a cow. I can see a couple <laughs> of sheep, a couple of pigs, and a cow. And then to the other side, it's got a couple more sheep. A pig frolicking in some oil. Um, <laughs> there's a pig and a sheep frolicking together in the oil. Well, that sounds like blasphemy. That's <laughs> unnatural. Mm. I'm noticing that we've got quite a lot of oil out in our... We have. I can, I can, you know, there's yeah, two bits have, like, there. Got, yeah, there's, like, there's two bits just there. I, well, in these, in my view distance, I can see there's the one in the one in the water, two in the desert, and I did oh, find yeah. a pool in the desert as well. I can see two in the desert. Not much oil, but still. And so, yeah, it's like quite a lot of oil. So we might might do something with that. We may least, do. Of course, we can at least pump it at least, get it out of well, get yeah. it out of there where it's being wasted. Stop it being yes. in the environment. Anyway, instead of doing all this, I'm going to go off and see if I can get some goodies. Well, while you do that, I'm just going to go over this way. Oh, hang on. I've walked over here and now there's eight and a half million animals. <laughs> oh, yeah. They're all back. They are still here. <laughs> oh, that's all right then. I thought we lost them. <laughs> I fell in a puddle. You fell in a puddle or a portal? A puddle. A puddle. A puddle. I think I'm going going the right way to get to yes here we are you should have a waypoint get a waypoint i don't know how to set waypoints press m hit waypoint make one <laughs> ah You've got a mini map haven't you seen i've seen or you could always just press c and it goes directly to the waypoint uh, yeah i did yeah. I, but yeah i didn't know you could do that and it scared the hell out of me so <laughs> i ran away right i need to oh, there's loads of food here we need to cook this food up because i'm gonna need food if i'm going mining i need food damn it Cook me food, woman. <laughs> sorry, sorry, women. They're everywhere. <laughs> but yes, for those of you listening in, um, like I said, this isn't tech it, um, but we do have a lot of uh, similar mods. Well, a lot of the same, really. We've got, you know, the regular ones, build craft, industrial craft, equivalent exchange. We haven't nerfed equivalent exchange because that's pointless. Um, a bit of animals on the dojo. <laughs> no, not animals on the dojo. So this is the future site of the Tech Ninja Dojo. So I'm going to start off by clearing it out of uh, this mud. Animal, in animal incursion and mud. <laughs> On my stream right now, you're watching me cook beef. How exciting! Mm -mm, beef. <laughs> the tasty alternative to no beef. <laughs> I'm currently having a quick wander around the rubber tree plantation trying to get some more rubber rubber because <laughs> we're out of wood completely again i know it's, 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 a little while ago we were out of dirt which i think before we started recording it's like ridiculous how can you be out of dirt no one <laughs> ever runs out of dirt ever. it's fine i've got plenty over here oh, dirty boy <laughs> oh you're just dirty dirty boy Oh, I think, can I get out? Oh, yeah. More resin. Uh. If you get that excited over resin, people are going to think it's a different kind of resin that you're farming there. It's just saying, it isn't. Mm. Mm. <laughs> no, I haven't got that mod installed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, there's my idea gone. <laughs> Yay, um. weed plantation. Get in the resin drum Who needs drum. weed though when you can have egg sandwiches? Yeah. Who <laughs> needs? <laughs> Damn it, pig. Okay, so I flattened the location. 
I think I'm very tempted just to chop all these, all the surrounding leaves from all these rubber trees, and then. That's what I normally do. Just leave the branch, just leave just... the trunk, because they still regenerate. Normally... Well, I normally leave the top leaves just so I can tell at a glance that they're rubber trees. I don't need to think is that the right color wood, but. <laughs> And plus, it, once I put some walls up, I'm not just going to have random animals wandering through. Um, yeah, that's a, a, a good thing. You don't really want random animals everywhere. Yeah, it's preferable not to have random animals coming in, trampling on all, all your stuff. Um, I'm going... I think I've collected quite enough. And anyone, go, anyone, If you ever go to my screen, you just have 15 minutes of... Resin farming. There we go. Ah, <laughs> so. oh, but you're going to get on to, to, to the good stuff now, aren't you, Sean? Yeah, I'm going to try and get these shenanigans on the go. And we have got some unrefined stuff. Or, 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 or do we want to wait until John's made some kind of... Um, because obviously the machines are going to go to the Sound Tech Ninja Dojo. Come. I don't... Uh, no, just, no, I, I think we should get them made up anyway. He seems to be exclaiming quite quite massively over there. <laughs> oh, what do I keep doing? I, keep... I, was, I was trying to um, capture a dodo. A dodo? I mean chicken. Oh, a chicken. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember the plan now. Yeah. <laughs> we have a plan and everything. Yeah. Can you tell? <laughs> yeah. It turns out dirt doesn't really work for that purpose. No, not really. Not really. Like, I think, well... To get animals, you, so you can you can obviously entice them with wheat to get them in somewhere. And yeah, we have a couple of bits of wheat, I think, laying about. Do we? I know we've got reeds. I'm going <laughs> back to the cave to uh, pick up some building materials. Yes. Um, we're so going to do, for the dojo, it was going to be three blocks of marble, then a block of something else to break it up, wasn't it, Sean? Yeah, um, um, I, I I would suggest basalt. Mm. Yeah, that's what that's what we were thinking as well. And like I said, there is what I found earlier. Which if I quickly go, yes, on, there is a volcano turn, nearby. Turn on my waypoint, and we've got Mount Biscuit in the distance. Haha, <laughs> Mount Biscuit. Mount Biscuit, which is to the kind of northwest of the Indy Cave. So go over here. I'm just going to go and see if I can hunt out some nice new caves to look into. I'm going to try... I can't remember if you can... Can you mine basalt with just a normal pick or with a, can, like a stone pick? Yeah, or? you can do it with a stone pick. So, I'm going to try and have a look at this. I'll just have to try and mine as much, just mine a bit of it. I know I'm trying, I know I'm, I'm supposed to be going into all the machines and everything. Because <laughs> <laughs> the main thing, but I'm going to mine some damn basalt. Exploring's <laughs> fun though. Ow. Yeah. My shoes! Mind the, ca Mind the cactus. <laughs> some damp basalt, we can actually get the dojo. I didn't realise that Mount Biscuit has, has quite some, a lot of sheer faces of basalt, which is quite weird. I'll tell you what we can do as well, because it's going to be a sort of a, 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 a sort of a, a Japanese style house. If we make a hand saw, we can start chopping up bits of wood into oh, the little yeah, strips just, and stuff. Yeah, just make some, make some decoration pieces for the... Well, no, it's not that, but just just put little wooden strips almost on every block, so it looks like sort of, you know, the wooden frames that they'd oh, have yeah, on the... Oh, yeah, like the, uh, the, the, the sliding door things, yeah. Yeah, that kind of thing. I think that'd look quite, quite cool. Yeah, that would, look, that would look quite nice for... Especially, obviously, for a Japanese-inspired building. Yes. It's, uh, it's a very, very good thing. There's loads of beehives in this forest. I'm going to have to make I a know. scoop later. <laughs> And gather just, some I, up. Pretty much as soon as I come in, I was like, I like climbed up a little bit up the Indy Cave and looked across the desert, and there was like hundreds of them. <laughs> <laughs> All over the bloody place. For God's sake, how, how many bees? Why are there so many bees? I haven't so even. I don't think I've even installed extra bees. <laughs> Otherwise, that would have been madness. Madness. This is madness. No, this is Minecraft. <laughs> you know what would be a really good idea to have done before I started building the uh, indie, but not the indie cave. The Tech Ninja Dodo. The Tech Ninja Dodo. <laughs> the Tech Ninja Dodo. What the flying hell? Uh, yeah. 
It would have been a really sensible plan to have picked up a pickaxe. It would have been. Yes. I've just broken my pickaxe. I'm going to have to go back. <laughs> I just climbed, climbed Mount Biscuit, but... Because I just placed down some marble in the wrong place. Oh, that's a silly move. That's a silly thing to do. I shouldn't I have done that. I placed some marble where there should be basalt. Just out of interest, are you doing it in plain marble or are you doing it in marble bricks? Well, that's what I'm currently doing it in plain marble. Fair enough. But I am open to suggestions. No, I think maybe because I, li I like the look of the plain marble, but I'm I'm thinking you might want to turn the basalt into bricks. Because plain basalt looks a bit dull. Plain no, no, marble looks all right. Wow, I'm lagging a lot. I don't know what the hell's happened here. I think, I think I've just managed to wander into a high spawn area. <laughs> I think I've just been, I've been crippled by by pigs. <laughs> <laughs> Pig based lag situation. It's never good. Oh, oh drowning! <laughs> there we go. Oh, I think I don't. I don't even know if I'm on the right side. <laughs> I should have bought torches with me. I need to get some wood, I think, before I go go spelunking again. Wait, no. We have... Um, oh, no, we don't. <laughs> we do? We don't? What? Who? I thought we had some stuff to make better picks with, but we don't. Yes, I can. Um, uh, we have got iron, but... It depends how much you want need to do for the uh, machines. I, kinda... I can work with uh, stone picks for now. I'm trying to make my way back to the cave, but I'm lagging so much. <laughs> it's like... I mean, I've got an iron pickaxe, so I'm going to start hopefully picking up some nice gemstones. So uh, then we can start making tools out of those. And then uh, they last a lot longer, as well. Yeah. Well, I've got sto a couple of stone pickaxes so that I can move my marble around. Uh, I'm gonna have to jump off my options here because it's it's completely <laughs> my my frame rate has completely died. <laughs> Video settings. Yeah, I keep remembering having to put torches down because my screen's so ridiculously bright. I usually don't bother. <laughs> But I know that on YouTube this is just going to be like black. <laughs> Should we maybe go back to the, uh, the the cave and rest for the night? Um, I'm sort of deep down in a cave, so I'm a bit stuck at the moment. <laughs> Fair enough. I guess I'll build through the night then. Well, just uh, see, see if it works for you. I mean, it, it made point. It, 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 it worked for me. What? Well, so, who knows? It could be because it recognises you as its king. Yes, possibly. <laughs> you are lord of the... <laughs> I am finding loads of appetite. I'm going to have to start getting the farms running soon, I think. Yeah. I, I found a little bit of it as well. Yeah, I've got... I put some in the uh, chest. I've got like 26. <laughs> it's ridiculous. 